Today we're gonna to make this crispy shrimp gataifi appetizer with a galmata olive aioli. I'm Nikki Gluckis and this is Nikki's Modern Mediterranean. To get started on making our crispy gataifi shrimp appetizer, we're gonna start with shrimp. So here I have six jumbo shrimp, deveined, cleaned. I did leave the tails on, so I'm gonna leave those shrimp in this little bowl. I'm gonna add a teaspoon of olive oil. So teaspoon of olive oil, a quarter teaspoon of pepper, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. We're gonna give that a little toss. So we're just putting some, of course, olive oil, salt, pepper on our shrimp. And then next, what's really nice for this appetizer is we're gonna skewer them. It's gonna make it easier for us to roll them in our kataifi, which is shredded phyllo, which is gonna give a really nice crispy, you'll see a nice crisp on the outside of our shrimp. So we're gonna take our little skewers. Um, we're gonna take this shrimp here and we're gonna skewer it from the tail. Try to get it right through the shrimp. Like that, so you can make it a little bit more straight. And again, you know, we always try to give you some creative ideas for appetizers when you have people over. This is, lots of people love shrimp, and this is a different way of making shrimp. So we're screwing those up. Perfect. So all of our shrimp are skewered. Next, we're gonna roll them in our filo. So, like I said, kataipi filo is like those long sheets of filo that you guys always see me using for different desserts, but this one's shredded. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna make some, you don't need too much of this. It's hard to tell me the, tell you guys the quantity, but if you could see here, I'm gonna make like a line of the kataifi. I would say this is about a handful of kataifi. That's how much you would need for each one. So we're gonna take that, line this up. We're gonna take some olive oil, drizzle it right on top. Then we're gonna take our shrimp and we're gonna lay the shrimp down so the skewer's right here on the outside and you're gonna tightly roll the kataifi around the shrimp and you're gonna kind of Get, the olive oil is gonna help get it to stick, so I'm gonna roll it back and forth on the surface. Don't worry, I cleaned this before. So we're gonna roll this all the way until you have this adorable little shrimp on a stick. <laughs> we're gonna lay that down on our baking sheet, which is lined with parchment paper. So again, I'm gonna take about a handful, I'm trying to give you guys some measurements here. A little olive oil, lay our shrimp. Roll that in. Soak up all that olive oil. So usually you'll see kataifi filo is made with a lot of desserts, but we're making this savory appetizer. So our shrimp are ready to go in the oven. We're gonna bake these for about 10 minutes at 400 degrees. So while our shrimp is cooking, we're gonna make a galmata olive aioli sauce to go with it. It'd be great for dipping. So to get started, we have our small food processor. We're gonna do a cup of mayo. And you can just put all of these ingredients all at once into this food processor. We're gonna do a quarter cup of galmata olives pitted, of course. We're gonna do a teaspoon of garlic, minced garlic, a quarter teaspoon of salt, and a tablespoon of fresh lemon juice. So there's lots of different sauces you could do for this shrimp, but I thought this would be a delicious one so we can use the olives. Perfect, our sauce is ready. We're gonna get, go check on the shrimp.
So our shrimp are ready. Look at this beautiful color on our kataifi. You could see that the shrimp are cooked nice and pink, perfect. So we're gonna take the skewers and I just have our kalamata olive aioli right here. I'm gonna plate this up. This is an easy and beautiful appetizer. For the full recipe, visit NikkiKlekis.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.